right, in this video, I'm going to talk about blood wood, and we are going to do a test, a hardness test. I'll shoot it with a 9mm bullet and see how many inches it takes to stop it. Now, when you're researching woods, I, I definitely recommend that you check out the wood database. I love this site. And this is where I first go to look at woods, where they came from, what their Jenka hardness is, uh, their workability, um, how they, you know, they, do they resist bugs, what people are making out of this wood and things like that. So just great general information. I recommend you look that up. Now let's look at the Jenka hardness. This is the Jenka hardness scale and it rates at 2,900. And of course I'm doing my own scale with, um, you know, with this bullet test. Now, for some reason, I was under the impression that this wood was from Africa. And I think that's because I found out by studying more today that there are many other woods that are known as bloodwood. But this bloodwood, and here's the scientific name, I don't really care to try to say it, uh, is grown in South America. If you do a Google image search of that specific uh, scientific name, then this is what you'll see. These videos are for entertainment purposes only. Please do not try to imitate this or think of any of this as woodworking advice. All right, we've got the blood wood and I apologize for not hitting close to center that's embarrassing uh, but I think I just squeezed the trigger too hard and you can see that you can pretty much already see down there and look at it so let's see how many inches we've got So it just dented that third piece of wood. Wow, that it wow, that like flattened the, the bullet. Let me see if I can show you. Can you see that all right? It flattened that bullet. Let's see if I can pull it apart. Oh, I can get it out. Wow, look at that. Look at what it did. That wood is so hard. So while editing the video, I realized that, you know, this is, it's not where the hole is. So it must have made that hole, hit that third piece of wood, and then bounced up. Crazy. Let me know if you have any other uh, theories on why it looks like this. All right, man, that was amazing. So we went in there, got stuck there, dented that one. So we're talking just right at two inches. Now let's see, no, even better. No, one and 15 sixteenths. Wow, that's awesome. I'm still so impressed by that bullet. Now, just a reminder, I'm using a 9mm round, 115 grain, full metal jacket. Um, and I'm shooting at approximately 7 feet away. Now, this is the scale I have so far with Bloodwood, Purple Heart, Red Oak, and Black Walnut. And you'll see that my scale is kind of the opposite of the Jenka Hardness Scale. Because the Jenka Hardness Scale is about how much pressure it takes to push a steel ball into the wood. And my scale is how many inches it takes to stop of that wood to stop a nine millimeter round. Stay tuned for more woods.